Before using an elbow crutch, you may need to adjust it to the correct height. The top of the crutch handle should lie just below your wrist crease line. Place the crutch a short distance in front with your injured leg. Step your non-injured leg forwards to lie between the crutches. When turning or manoeuvring in tight spaces, ensure you step round in a controlled manner to change direction. As pain and balance allow, increase your stride length. To ascend stairs safely, step your feet to the edge of the first step. Place your hand forwards on the banister. Step your non-injured leg to the next step, followed by your injured leg with the crutch. Repeat these sequence of movements until you safely reach the landing. To ascend stairs with no banister, step your feet to the edge of the first step. Find your balance point through the crutch and your injured leg. Step your non-injured leg to the next step, followed by your injured leg and the crutch. Repeat these sequence of movements until you safely reach the landing. To descend stairs safely, step your feet to the edge of the first step. Place your hand forwards on the banister. Place your injured leg and crutch down to the next step, followed by your non-injured leg. Repeat these sequence of movements until you safely reach the landing. To descend stairs with no banister, step your feet to the edge of the first step. Place the crutch down to the next step. Find your balance point through the crutch and step your injured leg down followed by your non-injured leg. Repeat these sequence of movements until you safely reach the landing.